John, you just came back from National Conference, and what is your uh, top trend from an executive standpoint that you would like Ex to share? Like executive coaching? Yes. Well, executive coaching has taken a turn because more and more people aren't just trying to just get better at the job that they're in, but they're trying to diversify that talent within the company. So what we're seeing the trend as a more of a career advisor and outplacement, we're being brought in to help propel people's career while they're working and they're not in danger of being laid off. To keep them engaged at work, uh, we're finding out that the more you have some outside intervention, not just a, a consultant to come in and say, here's what you gotta do to change the company, but someone to come in and work with some of the executive team to prepare them for the challenges, the next challenges that we'll face in their ever-changing career. So we're now being brought in not just for outplacement when someone's being laid off, but also to prepare them for the challenges within the business. Now, if in that time, we see that maybe there's a change in structure or they need to take on a new responsibilities, we're coaching them while they're at their job to take on those challenges. So the big change is, it isn't just an afterthought. The companies are now bringing us in and our team to work with the people inside to make sure they're really engaged and they're doing well. That's the big one of the big takeaways. So it's being, being more proactive. Oh yeah, that's that's what we're seeing today because they're trying to retain in a tough employee market that it's turned into. Uh, they're trying to retain their best talent, and the best way to do that oftentimes is to provide them guidance inside the company to best perform, but also to progress their career within the company, and we're being brought in to do that.